hello and uh, welcome back everyone and in this video uh, we are going to talk about uh, another important function which is the for each and it's being used everywhere so whenever you need to uh, to do the iteration onto the array or any iterable object you always use the for each method like you did document dot query selector all so it will give you all the array elements uh, uh, all the dom elements having the button elements so consider like it, it's going to be at the list of all the divs comma separated and then you are actually iterating on to all those buttons array and dot for each so it is also the kind of a callback mechanism something like this so once you have the array array with all the elements then you can run the for each method on that and it accepts a callback function and you can just do with iteration whatever you want to do with i element okay because this is for purely for iteration where you can just uh, uh, do some do anything with the, the iterate, iterated element like here we are running the for each loop onto the buttons and to each and every button I am adding an event listener and this handle click is defined here so I am using this for each method to add this event listener to all the buttons exist with the query selector button right this is uh, straightforward right because I am getting all the buttons now I am iterating using the for each loop and I am doing it so for each loop is better than using the for loop in javascript and try to use a for each loop uh, it gives you the iterated element and then do whatever you want it to do it's uh, it's just for iteration it's not changing the original array elements okay that's it about for each uh, 